मैकेनिज्म ऑफ एसिडिक बाफा सॉल्यूशन दिस इज टुडेज लेसन इन दिस लेसन वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ एन एसिडिक बाफा सॉल्यूशन रिटेन्स इट्स पीएच वैल्यू कांस्टेंट इवन आफ्टर एडिंग अ स्मॉल अमाउंट ऑफ स्ट्रांग एसिड और स्ट्रांग बेस सो लेट्स गो टू द डिटेल लेट्स कंसीडर एन एसिडिक बाफा सॉल्यूशन ऑफ वीक एसिड सपोज एसिटिक एसिड एंड इट्स बेसिक सॉल्ट दैट इज सोडियम एसिटेट लेट्स सी दिस इज द सॉल्यूशन ऑफ एन एसिडिक बाफा सॉल्यूशन है एसिड इज एसिटिक एसिड weak acid and its basic salt that is sodium acetate we know an equation ph is equal to minus log of hydrogen ion concentration suppose ph value of this एसिडिक बाफा सोल्यूशन इज फोर पॉइंट सेवन फोर इन दिस सोल्यूशन देर आर टू काइंड ऑफ कंपाउंड उक एसिड एसिडिक एसिड एंड इट्स बेसिक सॉल्ट सोडियम एसिडेट हियर एसिडिक एसिड इज ए काइंड ऑफ उक एसिड दैट इज वाई only around 5% acetic acid ionizes to acetate ion and proton and basic salt that is sodium acetate it ionizes 100% to almost 100% to acetate ion and sodium ion when in this solution small amount of acid is added then concentration of hydrogen ion is supposed to increase and as a result this is supposed to increase concentration of hydrogen ion and as a result ph value is supposed to decrease but no change in the ph value happens let's see how it happens when hydrogen ion that means acid is added to acidic buffer solution then this proton combines with acetate ion and as a result acetic acid is formed which is a kind of weak acid as it is a kind of weak acid it doesn't dissociate to acetate ion and proton remarkably that is why the acid added to the solution is consumed by the acetate ion that is why concentration of hydrogen ion remains constant and as a result ph value remains almost unaltered unchanged this is for addition of acid in the acidic buffer solution and ph value remains constant even after adding a small amount of strong acid in short acid added to acidic buffer solution is consumed by the acetate ion to form acetic acid which is a kind of weak acid that doesn't produce proton again because of its weakness now let's see how 
pH value retains constant when small amount of base is added to acidic buffer solution. Now let's see when small amount of base is added to acidic buffer solution then how pH value remains constant that is in this solution small amount of base is added then this hydroxide ion combines with this proton hydroxide ion combines with proton and as a result water is formed so as this proton is reacting with hydroxide ion that is added to the solution as a result the concentration of proton is supposed to decrease and ultimately pH value is supposed to increase but pH value remains almost constant let's see what is the reaction when hydrogen ions are removed reacting with hydroxide ion here emptiness is created vacuum is created and for this according to la chatelier's principle some more amount of acetic acid ionizes to acetate ion and proton in this way the vacancy of proton is filled up by the unionized acetic acid so the base added to acidic buffer solution is reacting with proton and water is formed here a kind of vacuum is created that is filled up by unionized acetic acid and as a result pH value remains constant so here actually no change in the concentration of hydrogen ion and ultimately no change in the pH value in this way acidic buffer solution retains its pH value constant almost unaltered no more thank you very much